And guys, I'm back. Yeah. Good old Mercury Retrograde. Yes, yes, yes. So here's the music. That is the video that I will talk about later. The spirit made me listen, or wanted me to listen to, after my enlightening of Monday. And that song right there is beautiful. Make love where there was none. Mm. Hey, Kathy. So, a lot to talk about. I'm almost crying again. Oh, man. So, I have notes, all kinds of stuff I want to talk about. So, first off, hello, everybody. Um, this is a 99% clairvoyant reading. And, uh, yeah. And I don't know what else I'm supposed to say because he's talking about stuff already. So, that, um, if you're watching this now, please say hello. If you are going to watch some on my YouTube channel, please uh, subscribe to the channel. Please like the channel. Please leave a message on the channel. Um, check out my other videos. Uh, help me build the channel. Um, what else? <laughs> what else can I do? So please do that. Hello, Carol. Hello, Pat. Um, who else? Just I think Kathy, too. So, yeah. So, um, we're going to get started because I'm late anyway because of Mercury Retrograde. So, what a wonderful thing it is. We're in the shadow, Mercury Retrograde, the pre-shadow. Um, it goes um, into full effect on December 13th until January the 1st. So, our holiday is going to be filled with blow-ups, BS, and delays. So, if you're traveling, make sure that you pack your patience because the airports are going to be jacked up. There may be snowstorms. Um, car rentals may be jacked up. Uh, the bus system, whatever, is going to be jacked up. It is in Capricorn, of course. And hey, Allison. So it is in Capricorn, of course. It is the last one of the year. We've had four this year. Um, and we all know that Mercury is a planet of communication. And so don't buy a house. Don't buy a car. Don't buy appliances. Unless you are guaranteed that you read every single word of the contract. Because you'll get delays in that. You'll get delays in signing. You'll get delays in everything. So you have to make sure that you chalk it up to Mercury Retrograde. Now, if you have your birth chart, check which house in your birth chart Mercury came with you in, right? And that will tell you the section of your birth chart that Mercury's going to jack up, okay? And if you need more, um, text me because <laughs> there's a lot more. So, hey, Marcy. So, first thing we're going to do is talk about my awakening on Monday. Um, I mean, it's major, major league. If you didn't see it on my Facebook page, um, that's the music that is in the video that I've loved since I was, since probably for 12, 13 years. Um, her voice is angelic. Hey, Sherry. Um, hey, Marcy. And, um, and it touches me in ways I never knew why or how until now. Okay. So we could go today, Thursday night. I dreamt, I didn't sleep all night. I had this in and out stuff. And, um, and, uh, it's one of those dreams that is a clearing dream, right? Well, everybody in my dream was from high school. Okay. Elementary school, junior high school, high school. And they all disappeared one at a time. And I had 350 people in my graduating class. That's a lot of people, right? But I've known most of those people my entire life. From five years old on, if not before. So I was like, well, that's kind of weird. Don't know, what, don't, don't know what that's about. I was exhausted on Friday. I'm just exhausted. Went to bed thinking, yes. You don't, you, you, it's usually only a month or a month. A night of, um, of destruction, let's say. Um, clearing. And um, I thought, okay, I'm going to get a good night's sleep. No. I was awake all night. Sleeping awake, sleeping awake, right? In that space of absolute just being there, right? Just floating. Nothing's moving forward. Nothing's going backwards. I'm just floating. And that night, it was about my family. And that was about pew, 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 them disappearing, okay? Um, and I went, well, that's kind of weird. You know, everybody's gone, but 
two, right? And my, and my niece and nephews, okay, that's fine. And then Saturday, again, no sleep. Saturday night, I thought, bone, or Sunday night, yes, Saturday night, Sunday morning, I thought, okay, cool, I'm exhausted, so I've got to go, be able to go to sleep. Well, I would be mistaken, because that night, in the morning, on Monday morning, now, I was in retail for 35 years, and I, and I was a manager and a supervisor and upper management since eight, it's 18, 1984, okay? And I left in 2014. So it's a pretty good chunk. That's when I was in management. Other times I was doing, I was doing selling and stuff like that. So I was in, I've traveled five different states um, and worked. I um, uh, had hundreds of employees. And guess what they did on Monday morning? They went through every store that I ever managed or supervised, mostly managed and supervised, right? Every employee that ever worked for me. Every employee from 1984 until 2014. And I knew every single person. I knew the names of every single person he showed to me in my sleep. Okay, yes, he's so-and-so, she's so-and-so, she's so-and-so, he's so-and-so, he's so-and-so. I'm thinking, I don't get this. So I wake up in the morning. I mean, I wait up till morning time, right? Don't wait up till like 5.30. When I finally went, okay, I got to get the hell out of bed because I'm not doing any good to be in to be in bed. So there was one person I didn't remember. And Spirit says, it's the muscle guy. Okay, who's the muscle guy? No, Bill, the muscle guy with the blonde hair who worked, who, who was always working out. And I'm like, okay. And I remember um, that uh, I had a female who worked for me. And any place I went, when I changed jobs, she went too. Her name was Lola. And, um, and then Lola popped up, right? I'm like, okay, well, that's Lola. And then I, then I was working and I was supervising a athlete's foot um, um, athletic shoe store in an outlet mall. And all of a sudden I saw this kid who's was 20 at the time. This was 1996, okay? He was 20 years old, and I remember, and I saw him in, his, in this blue athlete's foot shirt, and I remember him saying that he loved the smell of Abercrombie and Finch cologne. I went, oh, that's Mark. Where'd that come from, right? So I'm still kind of like flustered and angry, and I'm tired. <laughs> I just want to go to sleep. So Monday, I got up and, uh, you know, I had that epiphany, that's like that. And I got, I did something in the morning and then I went, okay, I got to meditate. So I did a meditation and from the wellness woman and I forget her name, wellness and still or something like, some, 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 or something like that. I'm stuttering really bad today, guys, because um, I'm so tired. Um, and so I did a meditation and I went, okay, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. And Spirit says, okay. You gotta do another one. I'm like, why? We only do one at a time. You gotta do. You gotta do another one. And I'm like, okay. He goes, do the Blu-ray. I'm like, okay. So I did the Blu-ray from the same people, right? And as I fin as I finished, I was completely just exhausted. Number one, number two, bawling my eyes out. Right? I'm thinking, okay, okay, whatever. Right? And so I'm sitting on the couch and I'm thinking, and I'm thinking, and Spirit says, watch the alchemy video. I'm like, why? Watch the alchemy video. I'm like, why? He goes, Bill, just watch it. I'm like, you know me, I'm kind of defiant. I'm like, okay, fine. I've already cried enough, don't you think? And so I watched the video and I'm going to cry at this guy, so be prepared. <laughs> I'm going to gush. Is... The video starts out, I love her voice. It all works out. I'm gonna kind of give you a little synopsis of this. A little thing, right? So, the, there's, a, there's a woman in her car and she looks over to her left and, there's, and her husband is kissing somebody else, okay? And so, um, he sees her, she sees him. The girlfriend sees her too. She goes home, right? And, um, and she gets in the pool. She's trying to kill herself in the pool, right? And her body won't let her. She floats right to the top. Floats right to the top. Floats right to the top. I'm like, well, yeah, okay. That makes sense. She's, she saw this and she doesn't understand 
um, how he's got a girlfriend. Um, so she goes back in the house with bare feet and you see her feet going across the floor. Okay. And she stops and he shows up in the hallway. And then you see his girlfriend. And she just goes, I don't get it. What again? I'm thinking, why is she in her house? Number one, I've always said that, right? And she walks out. She, she walks out the back door by the pool, walks into the woods by their house. You can tell. It's like a Florida woods where there's not a lot of ground, not a lot of ground, like trees that have a lot of bush on them, right? It's a, a, a lot of branches and leaves and the dirt is kind of wet. And she hits her shoulder on one of the trees and she falls to the ground and she dies of the pill she took when she got home. Okay? So, Spirit explained this to me as the video is going on. <laughs> I'm bawling my eyes out, right? It's transformation, right? It is absolute freaking transformation. Her seeing them was me seeing my new self. Okay? And I was and I'm the female, of course, because of the gay thing. And I was like, I was like, okay. He says, Bill, that's you. I'm like, that's me. Where? With the guy. I'm like, okay. I'm like, okay. So I'm listening and crying at the same time, listening to him, right? And she gets home, and um, and like I said, uh, she goes in the pool. He says, that's you trying to kill yourself because of what happened. And guys, I'll be honest, that was me in my childhood, in up, to, up to about 45 years old, okay? I had suicidal thoughts my entire lifetime because I didn't know what the voice in my head was, okay? My brother was the same exact way. Only he became a drug addict and spaced out and things. He did, he did, he did not... He did not go the route that I went, right? And every time that I would think about that, I would think about my family, right? There's no way the kids, I didn't want the kids to see Uncle Bill or my sister. So we go through the, again, the video's going and she walks, they walk in. And again, Spirit says, that's you. That's what you're here for. That is, that is your old self. And I went, What? My old self, yes, your old self. So the video goes on, she walks by the pool, she gets out in the forest and she bam, shoulder goes and she goes down and she dies with her eyes open and her mouth open, okay? And spirits, that's your former self. Bill, that's you, you are no longer that person. You have to let that person go, Bill. And I was like this, only worse. And I was like, but Bill, that's you right there with the guy. That's you. Because she is the golden one. And I said, okay, but Bill, you're the golden one. You are the golden one, Bill. I wish that you would understand that. And I never did. I never believed what people would say about me, how much they love me, how much, how, how connected I am and all those things, right? Because my former self since, since birth didn't leave anything because I was not, I wasn't the pretty one, I wasn't the smart one. I wasn't the, um, um, all Billy does is work since 12 years old. All Billy does is work. All Billy does, why did I work? Because I didn't have to think about anything when I was a kid. Right, I was running three departments at a, three de three department store departments at seventeen years old in co-op. Nineteen seventy-seven, ran three departments in a department store in Montgomery Ward. Who does that? Me. So I didn't have to think. See, so after I sat for a while and I digested it. I totally get it. I totally get it. And of course, me being me, why now? Why? And he said, because, oh, this is so, fuck, 
freaking pro prolific. Pluto left Capricorn after 15 years, Bill. Now, <clears throat> all your dreams come true. So when I tell you guys, 2024 is going to be absolutely the best year of your freaking life. I'm telling you, Capricorn has mucked every, or Pluto and Capricorn has mucked everything up for the past 15 years, guys. Everything. I'm telling you everything. So when you have that epiphany moment, when you, when you, you don't even have to hear them, guys. It doesn't have to hear them. It's a feeling or a, or, or a prod, right? Do that one too. You don't have to say anything. But we know, I don't, we don't too, too, but I think I'm going to do that one too. That's them. You may not hear them yet. That's okay. Trust me. Keep that can of worms closed as long as you can. Okay? Because it is a burden that you have to understand. And it's not easy. Guys, it is not easy. It is not an easy burden to have. Right? Um, Heidi can tell you that. So... I mean, all of us are connected, but when you get the nudge, do it, right? Just do it. Pluto is only going to be, is only, it, it, it ends in Capricorn. It was out of Capricorn into Aquarius and it's back in Capricorn for, for this month. And then it's, um, it doesn't come back again until 2020, until 2024, for three months at the end, at the end of the year, just to wrap things up. So I'm telling you, when you get those proddings, when you get those situations, when you get those those messages, you can't speed it up. Spirit says, can't speed it up, right? There's everything in line is what's going on, and I can tell and I can tell you that my life this year has changed 100%. 100%, okay? Um, everybody knows Lee and I are not together anymore. But we may not be together at all. Okay, because this one's done. That's the next thing I'm going to talk about. Because, um, because uh, I've done this a long time with him. Going on eight, going on eight years. Um, and I love him, right? I love him. He's hurting right now. I get it. And I am absolutely going to be there. Because I'm not in love with him, but I love him because that's who I am, right? That's who I am. He doesn't know how to deal with anything. He doesn't have the capacity yet to know, to know everything, okay? So when you have those moments, freaking document them, please. Because when you are me, when you are me, only you're in an auditorium with a thousand people in the audience listening to you, that's how it's going to be, guys. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. And when you have your first revival, let's say, I will be in the front row going, ha ha, told you so, ha, told you so. You'd be like, oh my God, I can't believe it. this is me. I can't believe this is me either. And there's, there's so much ascension and so much change in 2024. You're going to, you're going to be like, what the hell is that about? It's going to be, and Spirit has said this before for the past six months, you think quantum leap is fast? Oh, no, 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 no. We're talking double quantum leap. We're talking by the month of March, your life will change. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. Mercury retrograde ends on January the 1st. All of January, all of March, or all of February, all of March. Okay? The last planet that is retrograde is Uranus, and it, and it, goes, and it goes forward. December, no, Jupiter goes December 30th. Um, Uranus goes forward January 27th. So we have five months, everybody, of 100% ascension. There's no planet that's retrograde. So every single person is going to speed so fast to the future. It's going to blow your freaking mind. Blow your freaking mind. In that little conversation we had on Monday with Spirit... He wanted to talk, and I'll talk about the one thing next, or yeah, is in a minute. Um, some of us love too much. Is that you in the mirror? Okay. What does that mean? 
You let people hurt you again and again, and you can't let go. My entire life. You care so much, every little slight change in energy, you think it's your fault. My entire life. Number three, um, you put so much into the relationship that you hope they'll give it back to you. My entire life, my family, everything. We love too much. And people would say, well, Bill, how, how can you love too much? It's what you invest in the people that you care for and you hope they give it back to you, but they don't. They don't. And I've always been that person. Um, my family, like I said, my family, my friends, just who I am, right? Oh, well, that was because I love too much. I wanted to treat me better without being mad at me. Well, guess who's mad at me now? Because I'm not having it. Mm -mm. Not going to talk me that. They're not going to talk me that way anymore. Not going to do that anymore. Not going to do that anymore. That's going to do that anymore. And I'm not doing this and this and this and this. Everything in the house for you without getting anything back. It's selfish. Okay. It's not selfish. I love too much. I'm going to teach my sister this too. <laughs> Trust me. My sister and everybody that I know in my personal life and you guys too. We love too much, and why do we do that? Because we want, we don't have a strong enough voice, we don't believe, that we can actually say, no, you're not gonna talk to me that way. The energy shifted, is it my fault? And it's not victim mentality at all, guys. It is the fact that I don't know why you don't love me. That's my family. It's a childhood. They never did. I was the odd duck. See? So all of us have those stories, right, programmed in our head. The amazing thing is, Monday took it all away. Because I'm the golden one. Then I have to work on that, right? Because I don't believe that. And when I get everything that I want, which is quickly, it's all backed up, right? Everyone's going to get what you want. Trust me. 2024 is going to be so much transformation, you're not going to know what them going to do. All your abundance is going to come. Everything that you've asked for for the last year, two years, three years, is going to come. All of it. Because I'm telling you, by April of 2024, this world's going to be upside down changed and directly in four, in, 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 into fourth dimension. Got that from then again. This week is only, it's only, it's only, it's only Thursday. Everything shifted, Bill, when you shifted. Okay. Why is that? Because you're the golden one. Not that I'm God, but, and I don't get that whole thing, right? And I don't want that title. Face, I, don't, I don't want the responsibility of that. But that's the old Bill, right? Just leave me alone, let me do my work, I'm good. No, Bill, you have to teach the world, Bill. You have to teach the world, Bill. Why? Why do I, you signed up for it. Who the hell signed that? I told him that on Tuesday. Who the hell signed up for that? But I, I, I don't get it. Why would anybody sign up for that? <laughs> well, you did because you lived in 5D before, Bill. And now you're going to teach everybody what it's like to reactivate their fifth dimensional energy. Oh, never thought of that before. See? So, next thing, because I want to get this down. I want to get this down right because I've got all kinds of notes because I don't want to... I, I, I did notes for the first time in a really long time. Okay. Yes. So, next thing. See, this is like everything. It's just scratch. Okay. Next thing. Um, um, I'll do April again. April is a huge month. The, there's a solar eclipse on April the 8th that is the strongest in 100 years. Everything shifts on April the 8th. Everything's just a cataclysmic switch goes off like that. And we're all going to be leading up to that. All right? So as, as we get into 2024, January 1st, everybody, January 1st, like we've talked about before, we've got the, we have the solar, we have the solar eclipses, the lunar eclipses, right? And then we have, we have the, um, the um, winter solstice, right? Massive, massive. New Year's Day, massive. Again, just like it was for the past two years. 
we've come out of the pandemic shuffle, Spirit says, right? They took everything away from us in 2020. They did. Shut down. Had to learn how to like your kids. Had to learn how, how to learn how to love your husband again or wife again because you're always around each other, right? So there's all kinds of, of things that shifted. 2020, 2021, got back on the track in 2022 a little bit. 2023 is the end, Remember, right? Spirit has talked about 2020 to 2023. January 24 until January of 27. It's in three-year periods. There's an, there is a, a crackdown. We lost it. We got a little bit back, a little bit back, a little bit back, right? We think we're all back to kind of normal, but people are still not feeling it, right? And 2024 to 2027, January 24 to January 27, yes, um, massive, massive ascension. I'm telling you, by the end of 24, you are not going to know what this was here. Spirit says it's all, it's all an illusion. We're going to understand that. Do we understand it now? Some of us do, some of us don't. I get it. But I can't imagine it because I've never been in it before in 12,000 years. And neither have you. So as you start to see aliens, as you start to see everything that's been blinded from us, the UFOs, right? You start to see the Acterians. You start to see the Palladians. You start to see, see the Greys. The Greys were in my house, right? In 2018, three different times. Um, just, just again, um, all the things that we, that are hidden behind the veil, Spirit says, are all going to come through after, after April the 8th, okay? Because of that solar eclipse. Massive. Now, you're going to see more and more channeling on YouTube with, 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 with humans channeling different aliens, okay? Um, it's already been, the portal's already been open, Spirit says, all right? So if you don't believe that stuff, well, guess what? You're going to be seeing it face to face on YouTube or on specials on TV, ancient aliens for sure. All right. You're going to understand what that means with them because that's who you are. They were here in fifth dimension too. And then by 2027, we will have seen them come, op come out and be open, take their human suits off and their energy. And then they materialize as the beings that they are. And they will come to us first. Why? Because we're light sensors. We are the ones who know. They'll already be turned on, my friends. You're all going to be like, okay, Bill, this, is, this stuff is crazy stuff. And I've had people call me on the phone, have readings, right? Um, or join the Element Tribe, right? In fact, two, I got um, two, new pe two new people have joined. Janelle and... Oh, her son's name's Adam. It's only now. Um, Marson. Um, but two more, which is cool because now we're up to 25 people in Elements Tribe, which is pretty, which is pretty awesome. If you want to know what that is, BillHobart.com. Um, it's a coaching kind of, kind of uh, membership that you pay for a year and you get your 13th month free, which is kind of cool. So um, that is all moving really, really, really fast. And some of them have called me and went, okay, Bill, um, what did, uh, <laughs> what is going on? I all of a sudden have these visions and I all of a sudden have this and I all of a sudden have that. Um, what, it just happened. Oh well, yeah. Because the, the blessing is the kids who are 40 and younger, I call them kids, I'll be 64 in three weeks, right? Um, they don't have that much to lose. They don't have that much to lose. People that are older than 35, we got baggage. That's stuff we got to work through, stuff we got to work on, stuff we got to go, okay. And when we do that, it opens up the door for your guys to sit your ass on the couch. You're doing a meditation, and then they <laughs> they kill your former self. Basically, basically what it is. I know from them, they did that for me because I have to see it. Trust me. 12,000 years on this planet, and an ego that is like this, and I try to calm it down, and I try to move it aside... But I'm skeptical about everything. I always have been, right? And Spirit knows that, and it pisses the hell out of him. It pisses them all off, like, what don't you get? Oh, uh, you know. 
And I'm that now 10% of the time. It was 50% of the time when I started this journey nine years ago. Maybe 60%, okay? So be prepared. When you get the nudge, do what they tell you to do. Meditation. Lose friends. Lose family. L right? Change jobs. Whatever it is, they're going to get you to do it no matter what. So just connect with it and do it, okay? And not worry about, oh my God, what if? Oh my God, what if? Because that is the biggest bridge you have to cross. Only in 2024 and beyond, you won't even have those thoughts. And if you do, they'll do something to get you to go pay freaking attention. As your lights are flickering and you got a voice in your head or you got, or you got this feeling in your chest of excitement and wonderful and, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. And your family, family looks at you and go, what the hell's wrong with you? True. The kids already have it. The kids already have the sense of wonder and thinking, why is it so bad here? They don't know why. But like, and if, he, and if they're good parents, they go, oh yeah, that's my star seed. Oh yeah, he knows, she knows, blah, 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 right? Yes, 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 right? So we're gonna go through a metamorphosis that will surprise everybody. And the way Spirit shows me this, not in the death thing, but shows me for the, for the, for the collective, is that like a caterpillar, when it's gonna transform and be a butterfly, we kind of melt down we have a little time where we kind of melt down and be a, and be in our little cocoon, and then when we come when we come out of that because we're being reborn, you awaken to this thing of and Spirit has said this before. How do I know that? And how do I know that right there? And I don't know what that is, but I know what it is. I don't know, but I don't know what it is, but I know what it is. How do I know all of this all of a sudden? Because now you're the butterfly. Okay, and as we go into 2024 and beyond, your ancient DNA is gonna be activate, 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 activate. And you're gonna get a sense of wonder, like this is so freaking cool, I can't believe, but why now? Why? Because the first three years of the transformation are done. Got three more years of pure transformational bliss, right? Transformational bliss, where you metamorphose into this beautiful, amazing, so deeply connected to your guides and the universe that people look at you and go, who are you? What is that about? And then they see your light and light and light and light. And you go, oh, I see that person's light. Oh, I see that person's light too. I see, oh, that one too. And they all, we, and we all look at each other. I get that all the time. I know who those people are. They're not just looking at my light. They're looking at, oh, I know you. Oh, I know you. Oh, I know you. From the energy. Soul recognition, everybody. Soul recognition. And the ones that aren't soul recognition, they look and go, why is everybody looking at her? What's that about? Why is she going to this revival thing or this, 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 this thing at the auditorium? Um, why is she paying $25 to go see this woman or this man or everybody, whatever, right? Because that's just going to happen. That we are all going to be on a searching team looking for what this means, what this means, what this means, what this means, as you start to teach it. Spirit, I told you guys that for months. Months. For months. And people have said to me, Bill, I don't understand how. You're not supposed to know a how. I didn't know how. Quit my job after 35 years to do this for a living nine, almost 10 years ago. Did I know how? Oh, I thought it was going to be simple, easy. No big deal. I just talk. No. There's a lot more that goes into it. So dreams will come true next year. So God, ask for what you want. Ask what you want. Well, I'd like to have... No, 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 no. Spirit, I need you to bring me a hundred million dollars in cash. Spirit, I need... I, I want you to bring me $100,000 in cash so I can buy that $100,000 car right there. And then and when I'm asking, how about a new house? I need you to bring me a million dollars in cash for my house. In cash. See? 
Because if you don't ask for cash, they're going to give you something else. That still is good. You can you still spend it. But no, I want it in cash so that I can decide what I want to do with it. See? Now, there's a lot going on. End of 2024. No, hang on. End of 2024 and into, into, 2020, into 2026 is when our, 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 our spiritual self is able to telepathically talk to each other. 24 to about the, the end will be, the end will be about August of 2020, of 2026, Spirit says, um, that the top, that the top humans are able to do that. Others will follow us, right? They'll follow us. And also, Spirit has said before, um, we'll be able to telepathically go from place to place. Trans transport ourselves. Yes. And portals will show up around the country, around the world, where we can go. Again, how do we do that? Kind of like a Star Trek thing. How do we do that? I don't know. Something in here, right? And when it happens, get <laughs> it to you. You know, that's why our eating's going to continue to change. Drink more spring water. Right? Everybody's going to change what they eat and what they drink. Okay, and you can re you can res resist it if you want to, but guess what? You're still gonna do it. You're still gonna do it. Okay, so back to Jupiter going forward at the end of December. Jupiter is the expansion planet, right? Like I've said before, you're gonna get everything that you want because Jupiter makes it happen. Because everything for the past five months that, that we've all asked for, right? That's in the channel. It's going to start to move forward. Move forward. So after four or five months in 2024, okay, in, I believe it is in um, Leo, I think it's in Leo, um, is all going to happen extremely fast. Extremely fast. Because Jupiter is the largest planet in the solar system, and it is has everything to do with expansion, getting what you want, um, um, moving you from point A to point D very quickly. It's a two-year cycle, okay? So think about two years ago, 2021, and it's in Gemini. Energy is air, right? So that's why these last two years have gone really, really fast, because air goes really fast. When Pluto goes into Aquarius... Air. Our transformation is going to be absolutely two times quantum leap. I can't imagine what that is, but they know what it is. <laughs> he just went, it's going to blow your effing mind. It's going to blow your effing mind. Because we can't see that, right? We've never experienced it in this lifetime of 12,000 years. So when we get reacted from 5D, from 12,500 years ago, or further, right? Who knows? They tell me it could be, it. I know. We've lived in, this species, this energy has lived in 5D and higher three other times before. Okay. Way to prove it, but I'm trust them, right? And that would make sense because we're supposed to live in 5 and 60 and higher most of the time, chimes. Chimes, see, the other things are experience. Are <laughs> experiences? They're experiments. Experiments. The time of three D, which we which we again we've never experienced before, um, is over. Now we're gonna, now we're going to take you back to five D for let's say two hundred million years, two hundred thousand years, however it is, right? Because we're going to be able to live a really long time once we get past. January 1st of 2024, um, everything that we don't know, we will know. And that's the blessing. That's the blessing. Can we understand it? No. Do you want to understand it? No. I don't want to understand it because I can't. <laughs> I cannot do it. I am not that, I am not that, that 
patient, number one. Number two, I'm not a figure it out guy. I'm not. Like I said before, I'm a freaking prima donna and I'm, a, and I'm a freaking a lot of work. And they know that, right? It's the way I've always been. I'm, I'm high maintenance. I really am. And I take it on myself, right? That's always, but used to frustrate my parents and my family and my friends. That's going to take me an hour to take a shower and do everything. So you know what? I'll go last. No, you go first. Really? Okay. And then they complain because it took an hour. It's going to take an hour. It's the way it is. But I know who I am with that, right? And that's what's important. That's what's important. So we go to 2024, 25, 26. We're going on January 1st of 27. Absolutely different human beings. Spirit also says we will look different also. We will look different also. Okay? Um, and there's, okay, there's some... Some people will fight it. Some people will fight it. Some people will fight it until they want they want to do what their sister does or their brother does or whatever and transport themselves and they can't because they're too big. That's when they go, oh, shoot, I should have. Yeah, okay, no, get to it. Remembering, we, we rode a soul journey when we came here. That's gone. It's gone. Now, did we send a new one? Spirit says yes. But it's not as complicated as our third dimensional. Right? It's not as, it's not as ink, 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 in, mm, I can't say it. Intricate. He's talking really fast. It's not as intricate. It's not every minute of every day. It is a span of time, span of time, span of time. Because we'll understand that going into the future. That happened for all of us beginning in June of 2023. I kind of talked about it when Spirit said back in the summer, but I was like, okay, do I know what that means? No, <laughs> I don't know what it means, but I get it. I don't feel uncomfortable with, I don't feel uncomfortable with it. Um, and you won't, and again, you won't either because you'll connect to it and go, well, that makes sense. And your family will be like, what do you mean that makes sense? It doesn't make sense. What are you talking about? Or your friends. No, no, no way. Your spiritual friends. No, I don't think so. That's when you know you're here and they're not. They probably hang around you to be an energy vampire. We all know what that is. I'm around you to suck the energy off of you because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Let me find somebody that I can suck off from. Right? Let me get, I'm their friend. I love them. That's great. But you know what? I'm really here because I need to be around them because I'm happier. Come on. Have, have, have any of those friends? I did. Not more. They're, they're long gone. Okay? Spirit also says, hang on. Okay, multiple things will happen at the same time. Multiple transformational things in your journey will happen at the same time. Some you, some you will not notice until it appears, right? How do I know that? How do I know that? And how do I know that? How do I know? Because now they're working you 24 hours a day. So if you go into bed and you think you're getting a good night's, a good night's sleep, you'll wake up exhausted. Why? Because your body didn't, didn't have a chance to just be. <laughs> it says, we're pulling and plugging, we're pulling and plugging, we're pulling and plugging. Meaning they're pulling the stuff out like a old school operator, right? With all those holes. And they're plugging in what's new. What's the new stuff? What's the new energy? Activation. Activation. So as that can, I know, oh, wait, hang on. That's going to continue month after month after month, if it hasn't already started. Well, mine started a year ago. I'm like, what the hell is going on? I mean, I thought it was pretty good, but that's just my Capricorn believing I'm more than I am, right? Because um, it's easier. I don't, have to worry. I don't have to worry about anything. I mean, it took me five years to do a first meditation. So you know what? I'm like, no, I don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need that. Oh, when I first did it, I'm like, holy cannoli. That's crazy. I feel pretty good right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so, let me see, hang on. 
spirit, yeah, spirit keeps, yes. Journal, 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 spirit says. Again, I use my iPad. I can't write that well. Can't write as fast as he talks, right? Are you doing your sit downs five minutes, 10 minutes a day um, and being quiet and allowing them to connect to you? Hopefully you are. I mean, two weeks ago, um, oh, Angela's here. She's, Angela's the one who, um, with um, Chanel, who joined Element Packages. Element Tribe, yeah. So, um, yeah. So everybody should join them, I'm telling you, it's good. Um, it's surprising how good it is. I'll admit to that. <laughs> it just comes out, you know? But as, hang on, hang on, hang on. God, he's all over the place today. You can tell by my energy. Talk about the love, talk about the love, talk about the love. As we go forward, we're more loved. We show more love. Because all of our stuff has been removed. Genuinely lightly, right? Or before, it's like therapy, 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 right? More communication with your inner self, more communication with your higher self. Okay, this is kind of weird. Once people know who you are, they'll try to get you to read them. Try to get them to, they want to skirt the system, Spirit says. They, they, they think, because they're muggles, that I can go around things, right? That, okay, she told me what, what happened to her, I'll expect that too. No, it doesn't look like that. It's like with my incident Monday. When you get that feeling, or you get the, or, or, or you get the, 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 the connection, that they do that second meditation. I've done two meditations at the same time in my life. They'll, do, they'll just do it. Okay, fine, I'll do it. That's how impatient he gets with me. <laughs> so, it's like, so, so I do it. And, and then everything switched, changed. Okay? Um, and when you hear a song that you connect to deeply and you don't know why, okay? You like the song, you can sing the you can sing the song, it's a beautiful song, it makes you feel really good, makes you feel connected, makes you feel, makes you feel make, makes you feel. Don't be surprised if in your coming out, let's say, that song or something else is going to absolutely tell your story. Right? Tell your story. Did I think that song was good? No. Right? MacArthur Park by Donna Summer, 1979. Okay? <laughs> I remember very well. One of my favorite songs is that after she sings the first bit and she talks about someone's going to bring me something really good. I never knew what that was. Now I do. I was 19. Didn't know anything. So, again, it could be something from your younger life that comes up. Right? Comes up and it's and, and it is the video that you watch after or before. And you're sitting in this great energy. Then all of a sudden something in the song triggers you, triggers your spirituality, triggers you inside, your fifth dimensional self, right? There's a reason why you like that song. There's a reason why. Reason why. And They'll trigger you to watch that to watch that song, either on YouTube, or in the screen in your head. Because by then, being telepathic, right? Who knows how it's going to work out, right? So, when you hear a song that makes you happy, not sad, happy, filled with gratitude, um, hope, and I don't and I do not like the word hope at all, but because it's an ego word. Hope is an ego. Well, I hope that I get that. Well, if you don't, you can be okay. Well, no, I, but I hope I do. What does that mean? Because we're taught to hope. No, I believe. I believe I'm going to get that. Did I know that when I was younger? No. I don't think any of us did. Right? Especially born in the 60s, 50s and 60s. Or no further away. Maybe the 70s, possibly. But no. So, what I, what, what I did, I was going to quantum healing on Tuesday, and then... Um, and Brenda had me uh, channel 
after Monday. I'm like, you want me to channel? She'd done that once before. And I'm like, what do you need a channel for? I don't want a channel. I don't want a channel. This, I don't want to go just sit there quietly and see what they say. Well, that just blew everything up because I'm like, blah, 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 blah. I had no idea what it was saying her. And she was like, you need to be, you need to sit on your couch and channel with your phone on video and listen to what you say. Because she says, I don't think you get it. I usually don't. When I'm reading somebody, having a conversation, I can say something that is so freaking amazing and I will never remember it. Never remember it. Because I'm not in that conversation. They are. That's why she says, Bill, just sit and channel. So if you're getting that feeling now, if you're getting that, that push now, that's what you do. Don't write it. Channel it. Just put it down, put your iPad down, whatever you want to do. And just talk. Because you'd be surprised what your ego, when you're writing, does not allow you to say or feel. God's honest truth. Because what I did on Tuesday was effing amazing. And I don't say that lightly because, yeah. I'm start, I, 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 we all have to start thinking about ourselves as that. How freaking amazing we are. And not sit back on, but, but, but no. There's no time and spirit. None. And I believe that more and more as of today. None. Ours is linear. Until it's not. I'm telling you guys, 2024, 25, 26 is going to blow our effing minds. And the people around us who are muggles are going to go, what the fuck is that about? As more people around them lift up the collective consciousness of the world. Of the world. With spotted certain people who are going to be oracles and they're going to be this and going to be that that absorb the energy from the universe, they're like a um, they're like a a a um, television receiver, right? Yes, yeah. You know that we all see for like Channel Seven, Channel Four, Channel Two, or the radio stations, same exact thing. See, only they're in the universe from the Earth. Their energy was that high up. And all they do, they get, and their job is to do nothing but absorb the information that they're getting from the galaxies. I know two, two of those. And one is 26 and one is 28. And I'm like, you boys have no idea who you are. No idea. Well, that's kind of fascinating, but they don't really get it, right? They will. They will. We all will. That's the cool, that's the cool thing about it. Okay? So, okay, it's four minutes till. So, Spirit wants me to do this. There's holiday gift, gi there's holiday gift certificates, okay? Um, if you buy somebody a gift certificate, you get a 15 minute reading. It's an $85 value, okay? If you buy yourself a reading without a, certi without a certificate, but the certificates, um, uh, re re readings are on sale right now for 25 bucks off a piece. So um, get yourself a reading or get yourself some stuff you can use next year and add that extra 15 minutes on top of the reading. I know Nancy Pierce did that last year, I think. Yeah. So, um, uh, but, yeah, it's a good deal. You're saving like $125. Use it next year when you're going to need them and uh, you're not, you're not going to want to pay $155 for an hour. I hope you do. I'm not going to raise the price of anything. But I know that, um, that I'll be doing this, reading stuff, less and less next year. Because I, after Monday... I know where I'm going, and it is 1614 Halama Street in Kihei, Maui. So um, I'm thinking about that. I'm not planning on it, but I believe after Monday of killing my other self, my older self, where else am I going to go as I change? And I know as you, trans as you transfer out of here, meaning where I live, where I live, okay? But um, readings, there's elements, okay? Um, element packages, you pay for 12 months, you get a 13th month free, you can get 15 minutes, 30 minutes, 30 minutes, 45 minutes, 60 minutes, and 90 minutes with unlimited questions in every single package, okay? So it's a fantastic deal for yourself, for people that you know, for loved ones, for family, whatever, because it is so much better to be in our tribe and we talk amongst ourselves and the energy is really, really good. And you got a question, you just text me. And um, if you want to talk, you just text me, right? 
and you get 90 minutes a, you get 90 minutes a month or you get 60 minutes a month or you get 45 minutes a month or you get 30 minutes a month or you get 50 minutes a month but it's 65 percent off the booking price guys just pay for it all at once and the higher priced ones you pay one one you pay half one month and then two months later you pay the second one I give you a, I give you a month of a break you don't have to pay them consecutively one and one pay for them boom you're set on a track in 2024 and beyond to be able to interact with me every day you want to. I'm stepping into myself, can you tell? Yeah, pretty good at what I do. So um, I'm, I'm trying to believe that also. So it's a really good deal, BillHobart.com, ElementSessions.com. Um, they're great gifts, okay? Especially for 2024 and beyond because um, it's gonna be Life-shattering, Spirit says, because we're all going to be these people who absolutely know, and I can't wait to be that person. I cannot wait to drop my feet on Maui for the first time, and I can't wait to get, um, I just can't wait. And I'm going to get another dog, which is wonderful. I was talking to my friend Terry the other day about what happened on Monday, <coughs> and Bailey showed up. He's all in my neck, right? And this, okay, Bay, what? He goes, Daddy. I'm like, yeah, Bay. You need another. You need another baby. I'm like, you mean a putt putt? Uh, yeah, Daddy. You need another putt putt. I'm like, okay, but Daddy, you got to get him soon. You got to get him before the end of the month. I'm like, well, you got to bring me the putt putt because I don't know where to find a putt putt. I was calling him putt putt because he was slow because <laughs> he was so old. He like boom, <laughs> like oh my god, I wish he would die. <laughs> it's what he would. But Daddy, why am I still here, honey? I don't know why, but you're gonna have to go through it till the end. So that was kind of cool. I'm all excited about that. I'm like, okay, so I'm waiting for somebody to contact me about another Italian Greyhound. Um, most of them are scams, like on um, Facebook and stuff like that. They take your $300 and, and then you go to get to pay the other $700 or $800 or $900 for the dog. And it's a post office and um, they, don't have, they, don't, they don't have any dogs after you drove five hours to get the dog. And your hopes are all up and things like that. And the great thing is that's gonna change. All those people. Bye-bye. Because -bye. guess what? Karma's a bitch. Karma is a bitch. So, doggy's coming, which is awesome. Moving is awesome. Um, when? I don't know. I don't care. Just as long as it gives me a vision to the, fu to the future. And when you get those messages, messages, everybody, from me or from your guides or from somebody that's reading you, whatever, write them down and believe them. Just, there's no expectation. It was my fault the last five, last five years, expecting it, expecting it, expecting it, because they told me. Well, now I'm a little bit more open to them telling me something because there's no time and spirit. And the awesome thing is, another year, year and a half, will be the same th way. God, I can't wait. Can I wait? Can I wait? Yeah. So thanks, everybody. Um, Courtney of the Soul Thursdays at three. If you would please go over to YouTube in about 20 minutes and like the video, please leave a comment. Um, the more comments I get from people, the more they send the video around the YouTube planet, okay? Um, just put something down, because you guys are here live, but if you would do that for me, I mean, I think that right now there's like just, like there's 16 pe people that are live, 17 that are live, um, and I think last week I had like 149 that watched it, things like that, and I put it on the, um, on the feed, but I, I don't know why a lot of people don't, um, don't uh, say anything. But pass it around your Facebook, if you would. All right, so um, you know how to get hold of me if you need something. Um, I'm, not, I'm not gonna tell you how to do it because people take my stuff. Um, and uh, I'll see you next Thursday. Coach for the Soul, Thursdays at three. See you guys.